Hello everyone, welcome to my channel and thank you for watching. If you want to find out how you can connect a keyboard to your Fire Stick, then this is the video for you. I'm going to show you four ways to connect nearly any keyboard to your Fire Stick or other Fire TV device. So when you're ready, let's go and take a look. You can use the clickable sections below to skip ahead to any specific part in this video. If you're looking for a new VPN service, why don't you check out the links in the description below this video. Clicking on these links can not only give you a great discount off of your next VPN subscription, but clicking through these links also helps to support my channel. I do love using my Fire Stick, but one of the things that frustrates me is the lack of function on the remote, especially when it comes to typing in lots of information such as email addresses and complex passwords. So in this video, we are taking a look at some solutions. I have four ways to show you how you can connect a keyboard to your Fire Stick from a wired one to even one that you can use for free on your phone or tablet. You can find links to all of the products I'm using in this video in the description and pinned comment down below, so make sure to check them out. The quickest, easiest and free way to use a keyboard with your Fire Stick is to use an app called Amazon Fire TV. And you can get this app on your Android and Apple devices directly from your App Store for free. Once installed, open the app and connect it to your Fire Stick. Then you can select the keyboard from the top right of the screen. And from there, use your phone's keyboard to quickly and easily type in information. The Amazon Fire TV app has much more functionality than just a keyboard, from voice search, navigation, playback functions, and even quick access to all of your apps. I do have a separate video with more information about the Amazon Fire TV app that you can check out in the link above me or in the description below. All Fire Sticks and Fire TV devices come with Bluetooth built in, so nearly any device you have that is Bluetooth enabled can be paired and this includes Bluetooth keyboards. Your Bluetooth keyboard needs to be discoverable, so turn it on and make sure that pairing mode is activated. This can usually be done by pressing a button on your device to turn it on, but not all Bluetooth devices have an on button or a pairing button, so make sure you refer to the manufacturer's instructions for your device. Next, search for the Bluetooth keyboard on your Fire Stick by going to Settings, Remotes and Bluetooth Devices, and to pair a Bluetooth keyboard, from this menu, select Other Bluetooth Device. Your Fire Stick will then search for discoverable devices and you'll see it appear on screen when it's been found. Select the name of the keyboard to pair it and use it. You can connect multiple Bluetooth devices at once and I have a separate video with more information that you can check out in the link above me or in the description below. An issue with Fire Sticks and other Fire TV devices is that they don't have a USB port. Without a USB port, you cannot plug in a wired or dongle controlled keyboard. However, there is a very cheap addition you can purchase that will add a USB port to your Fire Stick, allowing you to then plug in USB devices. This is a USB adapter that you can purchase on Amazon for just a few dollars or a few pounds that simply plugs into your Fire Stick and gives you a USB port. You can now attach all sorts of USB devices to your Fire Stick. I have a wired keyboard and a keyboard that's used with a dongle and now I can use either of these with my Fire Stick. Simply plug the OTG adapter into your Fire Stick then plug your USB keyboard or dongle into the USB port on the adapter. Finally, plug in the power supply and load your Fire Stick back up. 
You can now do so much more with your Fire Stick and if you wanted to go all out, you can even add more than just one USB port with a USB hub that then gives you the ability to plug in other peripherals from a mouse to extra storage. If you want to find out how, check out my other video showing in the link above me or in the description below. I hope that these quick and easy suggestions on how to get nearly any keyboard to work with your Fire Stick has helped. Drop me a comment below with which option you decided to use and if it worked well for you. You can find all of the products used in this video in the description and pinned comment below, so make sure to check them out. As always, thank you for watching. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to hit that thumbs up button, comment and subscribe to my channel, making sure that you turn on notifications so you don't miss out on any of my latest releases. These small actions from you make a big difference to me and helps to improve how YouTube recommends my videos to potential subscribers. And I truly appreciate your help in making my channel grow. Did you know that I also have a very useful website where you can find even more Fire Stick information, help and tutorials. You can find a huge app library that is simple to use and you can download almost any app from my website right onto your Fire Stick using the Downloader app. You'll also find video tutorials, help and advice on other streaming matters that you won't find from me on YouTube. So make sure you check out firetvsticks.com and bookmark it so you can always go back and check for the latest news. You can also sign up to my newsletter that will keep you up to date on all of my latest video releases, news and how-to articles delivered right to your inbox.